that's what uh, our terminal is. Well, our main terminal. Yeah, I just want to stop right. I just, I just stop and grab my camera, do a little quick vlog. But yeah, I'm on basically on my way to the customer. I already picked up the product. I got a truck full of whipped cream. <laughs> like cans of whipped cream. I was like, that. I guess people like whipped cream like that, huh? But yeah, uh, I'm about to go deliver. Then, um, I don't know after that. Probably shut down. Probably go to the terminal. I probably not do. I, 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 I'm kind of debating because if I go there, they might want to do something to my truck, and that shut me down. I ain't, I ain't tripping it. Like if they do, because. a little time to, to rest up and chill over there they got the, they got like a little lounge they got a lounge they got a fitness center and stuff it's kind of chill over there oh man people in the canoe i always want a canoe man i always wanted to do that That little area straight, but you go deep in that little lake park where well, I'll be spooked. Got back home, New Orleans, man. They got that, uh, what is it, St. John Bayou? Bayou St. John? They, they got like uh, a canoe spot over up where you could rent the canoes <coughs> and um, go on the bayou. Uh, city folk, man, that shit, that shit looks so dope, man. I'm gonna try that shit. Man.
realizing uh, like how I want my future to look. It's crazy because uh, at one point, man, I, I never did that. Though. I just kind of, I just, for most of my life, I just floated through life, like thinking like. Uh, thinking like I had no control You know what I'm saying I guess it, it kind of sounds stupid But But when you really look at it man A lot of people live life like that man They live life Thinking and feeling like They not They can't control their life They can't really do what they really want to do
footage when I actually go to the customer. Woo -woo. Like the driving footage is good too though. I guess this this would be something good like for uh new drivers to like to really see or just anybody who's curious to really see what it's really like to drive trucks. Like this, you know what I'm saying? To see the real, the real, real, you know what I'm saying? It's like a lot of videos online. Like you get to see, you know, you, you get to see the dude and he talking, but the camera faces his way, like to his face. You don't get to see what he see, you know what I'm saying? Over here at the terminal. Uh, yeah, I stopped over here. Basically, I picked up a load. I don't know if y'all can see that. I picked up a load. Uh, well, I dropped off a load in America. And I was like, man, I might as well stop over here. Nothing in there. But yeah, this is our lounge, man. Ain't nothing special. Got a little pool table and shit. Pool table, food, food's ball. Table, good cards. Let uh, Gallic again. Over here, this is a shop. You could buy like, uh, like PTL shirts and everything PTL. Well, I don't think you have. To. Well, I think you do have to buy some of shit. It shows you how to uh, like, vending machines and shit. They got some little lounge in here. TV. This where I'd be at. Chilling. TV and shit. Uh, yeah, bro. Restroom, that's where the shower's at too. We got the fitness center. I had to come use this early, you hear me? Give me a little cardio in, man. Work out my legs, man, because my legs kind of messed up. <clears throat> Big, uh, that's the laundry area. So I just did my laundry and shit. This is showers. This is a regular shower. And bottom. Yeah, man, that's the driver's lounge, you hear me? <laughs> Damn, boy, my teeth sparkling. Yeah, a little bit. But yeah, man, I'm about to go. I don't know, man, I'm about to go chill, man. Be on the game. Oh, you know what? I'm, what I'm about to do, I'm about to edit a video, or at least start editing a video. But I just want to show y'all that real quick. I'm out, man. It's popping. Oh, it's popping, y'all. I'm chilling. I'm chilling at the uh, terminal. Uh, uh, I'm chilling at the terminal waiting for another load. Playing um, uh, playing Call of Duty. I think I played this too much. <laughs> Enemy shock RC has been destroyed. Like, it's a good Enemy joke. Too. 
good job. Capturing Alpha. Ooh. We lost the lead. We're capturing Bravo. The enemy is checked out. We're capturing B. I got some capturing A. I know what it is. I gotta kill the people first. Oh. That's what they're doing us. Be advised, hostile sentry gun spotted. Enemy taking Bravo. Enemy sentry gun has been destroyed. Heads up, team. Enemy UAV spotted. Test this joint out. Enemy UAV spotted. Losing Alpha. You're losing this fight. See, Alpha. Ooh, Enemy what? taking fire. That gun back. <laughs> We're capturing Bravo. Enemy shock RC is coming. Reloading. Follow me. Enemy taking B. Enemy shock RC. All right, I'm leaving uh, my terminal, the main terminal, while what I did like my training for my company, uh, PTL. And I was thinking about it, I was like, man, this this exact road was the first road I took leaving in the terminal. Like, well, this exact route. This the exact route I took my first time um, driving truck, driving trucks or whatever. The day I was with my trainer. Dog, my trainer, dog. Like, all right, boom, see, all right. When I came in for my orientation to drive trucks, like uh, after your orientation, you find a trainer and you drive with your trainer for 7,500 miles. Then after 7,500 miles, you drive with another driver just like you, like another rookie and you drive 10,000 miles. Then after the 10,000 miles, you get to drive by yourself. So boom, I'm leaving orientation. You did. I didn't have a trainer. So basically, like the management was just like, uh, yeah, if you, uh, we don't have a trainer assigned to you, but if you, happen to run across a trainer while you at the terminal just let us know and we could you know have y'all ride together or whatever train or whatever so boom i'm like all right so i'm like boom you did i'm about to start looking for a trainer now boom me in my head i'm like all right i'm gonna be in a truck with somebody I at least want them, you know, to be like, kind of like, that'll fit with, with my personality or like my lifestyle. You dig? So, you 
today because I like you know I didn't want to get in the truck with an old timer or uh, I ain't saying I'm I'm super young but I didn't want to be in the truck with no old timer and they'd be like you gotta lights out and you gotta go to bed at a certain time and boo like I I just didn't want to deal with that. I wanted somebody like you know hey you know, let's, let's, uh, man, if you want to, man, we've been working, woo woo, man, you, let's, let's go get a drink and hang out, you know, type shit, not really, like, be on some shit, like, yeah, let's go party every day and woo woo, cause, like, I don't really, I ain't really on that level no more, you did, you did, but anyway, so, boom, you did, I ran across a dude, you did, I, man, I saw the dude. I saw the dude, and he was like, you know, young cat. He probably, he probably a little older than me. You did. And what made me like, man, I, 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 I'm gonna try to see if he'll train it. The dude had on a Saints hat. You did. I'm from New Orleans, and I'm like, damn, I'm wondering if he's from New Orleans. So I'm with the rock, with, with the, uh, you know, chatting up with the dude, whatever. So boom. Then he like, yeah, I'm a trainer, you did? You like, yeah, bro, you know what? They had me train, they had me uh, about to train somebody else, but they drug test didn't, uh, didn't come back yet. So I'm gonna see if they could link us up with, with, with us. Link it up with, with, you know, link us up together. So I'm like, all right, boom. So boom, he made it happen. So boom, we, we riding the shit. I don't know, long story short, so we riding and shit, and you know it started all cool. You heard me? He, you know, he training me and shit. He did. Like I never, I never drove a truck a day in my life. Like even, like say even at like when I went to school, man, we didn't leave a yard, the yard, dog. We never drove on the road. He did. I got, I got tra training from driving a bus. You did, but not training like the driver 18 with it. I never did it, you know what I'm saying? So, you did, like, I'm saying that because in the beginning, it's like, that's how he was treating me, like, you know, boom, like, I'm a rookie. Then, I said probably like day two or three, he was training me like, like, he was acting like, like I'm supposed to know that know everything within two days. I'm like, he went to talking to me like regulars, like, dang you, you supposed to know that. Woo woo woo. Like he that nigga clearly said like that nigga like man. I'm like, that nigga like, alright, I'm just gonna say this one time. Woo 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 woo. You did. And I'm like, son. What you mean you gonna say it one time? Like, like in learning anything, to learn something, it's a repetitive thing. You gotta keep doing it over and over. You got, and you probably gotta keep saying something over and over. You know what I'm saying? It's like a teacher don't come in there and, and tell the kids, all right, the ABCs one time, and you just gonna get it the first time, like, oh, whatever. You know what I'm saying? You learn it. Anything you learn, it's a it's a, a, a continuous process. You gotta keep doing it, doing it, you know what I'm saying? And if you're the teacher, you gotta keep saying it like, oh no, you ain't supposed to do it, you know what I'm saying? So you did, I'm basically I'm getting in the truck, it's like it's nigga the tension so fucking thick you cut it with a knife, dog. We in this bitch like like buku tension, you hear me? against each other and shit so it's like i'm in that bitch i'm like damn i want to ask a question but every time i ask a question he getting mad and shit he did but long story short i had a bad i had a real bad experience with my first trainer he did uh we been supposed to do like three weeks together but on it, we only did like two. 
And that was a long ass two weeks, though. So what happened, I had to, what happened, I ain't do all my time with him. I was gonna thug it out, but I ain't do all my time with him because I had to go to court. You did? So, so I had went back home, and when I went back home, I had got a new trainer when I came back. Now my second trainer, man, me and him cool to today, you hear me? Boy from Atlanta, you hear me? Like, it's crazy. My first trainer, he from Louisiana. He was from like, uh, what that is, St. Saint, Saint Charles or Lafayette, something like that. I think St. Charles. So he a big Saints fan. I'm from New Orleans. I'm a Saints fan. I'm like, damn. You know, we we got some, some in common, but man, that shit is like, I don't know, dog. Like, dog, we didn't see out of eye at all, dog. And it, it, it got to a point I really like, I'm thinking we about to fight in this bitch, you hear me? But man, my, my second trainer, man, me and him was cool, dog. You did. Um, but when I got in the truck with him, like, we, we did a lot of sitting, you heard me? And so happened, man, we was sitting in Atlanta, where he from, so, man, we were, we were, like, we were just, uh, kicking around his hometown, you heard me? He had one of his pilots come pick us up, man, we riding around the city and shit, just before, uh, coronavirus and all that shit, we riding around and, yeah, man, we called, called some females and shit, chill with the females. He did have his good time, drink, you know what I'm saying? And me and him still cool to today, you hear me? But yeah, man, my, now I see, boom. Now when my trainer was done, my, out my first stage, I got in the second stage with my P2 partner. He was like a mixer of both of them. Sometimes this nigga cool, sometimes we just fucking just not seeing eye to eye, you hear me? And it was like, damn, like, it was crazy cause he telling me like, man, that's how his, uh, his trainer was. Then I get in the truck with him and it's like, damn, you acting the same way like how you say? I'm like, but anyway, dog. Well, me and him, unlike my, my first trainer, we could talk about shit, you hear me? You know what I'm saying? At least, you did kind of like clear shit up, you did. But I ain't gonna lie, at one point, boy, I was like, man, fuck that. I'm like, man, I'm like, dog. I'm not trying to fight with nobody. I'm like, before before anything pop off, I'm just gonna go ahead and tell them people, man, just take me out the truck and whatever, whatever, you hear me? You did, cuz in a, in, a long, in a long run, dog, that, that shit never be worth it, son. I didn't, like every time I done said, fuck it, you did, look. He did either I hit a nigga or whatever, whatever nigga. He did in the long run, dog. Like that shit don't be worth it. Yeah, I get a, a gratification. Yeah, man, he he know not to fuck with me no more. 